let's install the Mongoose Paginate plugin. Mongoose Paginate has installed. Now we need to register this plugin. Open the song model. I'm going to register it here. First, we need to import the Mongoose Paginate. Mongoose Paginate from Mongoose Paginate. You can use the schema method schema dot plugin. Hey Mangos, I would like to register my external plugin. The name of the plugin is Mangos Paginate. It will add the Paginate method to the song model. Let me show you the demo of Paginate method. Now I can use the Paginate method. Let's try to fetch all the songs. I'm going to send the request to fetch all the songs. Here you can see that it has added the docs array. Now you can see the total songs are 12. Here it says limit. By default, it has set the limit to 10. And you can also see the offset page and total pages are 2. You can also provide the values dynamically. Let me create the options. I can get the page and per page value from the request query. I will provide this value from the postman. Let's generate the options object. Here I need to specify the current page. Make sure you must parse this value to integer. Page, I'm going to set it to 10 and per page, or you can set the limit of this records. I also need to parse it into the integer per page value. Now I need to provide these options. I'm going to provide these options here. Let's define the page value. Let's say I would like to see only five records. You can also specify the page value and per page value. Let's say I would like to see 10 records or let's say I would like to see five records per page and I want to see the records from the page number two. I got the error request dot query is not a function. It's not a function. It's an object. And one more thing, I also need to provide the object. And the second argument is options. Let's try to test it again. The per page is five. And I would like to see the records from the page number two. Now I got all the records. Here you can see that. We have docs array and the limit I have set to five. And here is the page number two. The total pages are three. Let's say if I don't provide the per page value or page value, if you will send the request, you will find the empty docs array. That is the problem. I need to set the default value here. I'm going to set the default page is one. And you can also specify the per page. I'm going to set it to 10. Let's try to test it again. Now you will find the docs here. You can see that. Here we have docs. I got the 10 records. Limit is 10 and the total are 12. 